Get ready to listen to some of the stupidest shit to ever come out of a human being's mouth. Motivated. Determined. Resilient. Confident. Mentally untouchable. So already we've heard some of the most fallacious lies come out of this idiot's mouth. Motivated to do what? All these kinds of things. Resilient? Okay, I guess you're still around after all these people have talked shit about you all these years. I guess you could be considered resilient. But mentally untouchable? This man bans anyone, anyone in his fucking chats who says anything even slightly disparaging about him. Someone who can compliment just the other player for existing. He's going to ban you. So mentally untouchable? That's a fucking lie already. Notice I didn't say physical because no man is. So already within the first 15, 20 seconds or so, we have so many idiotic statements. Notice I didn't say physical because no man is. What the fuck does that even mean? Let's look up the dictionary definitions of the word physical. Number one, of or relating to the body. Number two, of or relating to that which is material. Number three, noting or pertaining to the properties of matter and the energy other than those peculiar to living matter. Four, pertaining to the physical sciences, especially physics. Five, carnal, sexual. Six, tending to touch, hug, pat, etc. physically demonstrative. Seven, requiring, characterized by, or liking rough physical contact or strenuous physical activity. All of these things define him. All of these things define human beings. You can touch human beings. Human beings can be carnal or sexual. Human beings are liking to rough physical contact. I mean, other pertaining to relate to the body. What the fuck is he talking about? He's saying does he doesn't physically exist on this plane? Because he definitely fucking does. I don't understand this statement at all. Unfortunately, our physiology limits us anything past that. And then he proceeds to say, unfortunately, our physiology limits us anything past that. Anything past what? The act of actually existing is what he's saying. Anything past what? It's not like he, I don't understand. It's not like he said, notice I didn't say godlike because no man is. Unfortunately, our physiology limits us anything up to that, up to godhood. I mean, he says past that, past the literal act of being in existence. Like it's, it's the base requirement of being a human being. More words can describe my presence, but let's not be selfish. I walk a path. He then proceeds to say, more words can describe my presence, but let's not be selfish. The, you, that phrase, let's not be selfish, is used when your intent is to now give credit to something else, or someone else, you know, another being, another object, another idea, something else. So if you're talking about yourself, you're like, oh yeah, um, I'm a CEO of this company, um, I graduated from an Ivy League school, but let's not be selfish. My wife also helped me very a lot, you know, or my comrades also helped me a lot and they helped me get to where I am. When you say, but let's not be selfish, you have to begin to talk about something else or someone else he says but let's not be selfish and then continues to talk about himself that doesn't make any fucking sense a path that was aligned for me since the beginning of time the creator gave me life through abundance so lord your god has these like ideologies that are almost akin to scientology which don't make a lot of sense um but then with this line he's harping or kind of like stealing from the christian bible um when he says you know he's given life through abundance which is it's supposed to be in abundance but you know ltg is not very educated when it comes to these things uh but yeah i mean it's the verse john chapter 10 verse 10 in the christian bible if you want to look it up for yourself or just look at the screen it, it's, it's like he's saying these things and then stealing from the bible it doesn't make sense allowing the correct blend of souls to cross paths but not only to make eye contact but to share passion with one another a passion that allowed human life to be conceived over and over and over again and through it all with proper planning, placement, and the correct space and time. So this has nothing to do with what he's saying, but what is this fucking video? It's like he lives in California, which is hot as dick out there, and he has a fucking jumper on, denim jeans, and fucking Tim's on, walking like a 
dickhead. I mean, well, he looks completely idiotic. I, I, I want to know what the direction was. He, he he talked to his boyfriend, DT, and said, hey, man, we got to make this, like, really clever video of, like, making me look cool. So I'm going to put on one of my favorite outfits and uh, walk around like a bell end. Here I stand. Mistakes made. Battles fought. Time elapsed. See, that whole little tirade he went on with, mistakes made battles fought time elapsed like yeah those are factual i'm sure he's made mistakes in his life um time has elapsed because that's how time works but like he says battles fought like what what <laughs> What what great tribulation have you fought? Unless he's talking about like Street Fighter battles or like video game battles. I mean, yeah, I guess that's facts. But like he's saying it like he's a goddamn king or Viking or some shit. Ridicule spew. I refuse to let the actions of mere fellow humans distract me from serenity. So congrats to um to Dale Wilson for using a thes thesaurus because he used serenity correctly in this sentence. But what he didn't use was mere. In correctly, when you say mere, mere is to diminish something else. So, let's say you're some kind of god, you can say, I refuse to let the action of mere humans distract me from serenity. Or if you're a human, I refuse to let the actions of mere ants, something that's beneath you. You know, he's speaking as if he's above and anyone else who's trying to distract them from serenity, quote unquote. But he says mere fellow humans. So he's saying that they're mere or insignificant in the sense, but he's saying that he's one of them. So is he also acknowledging that he's insignificant? Cause that's kind of meta. In this life, do you feel a purpose, a longing, a yearning itch for completion? Why is he feeding fucking ducks and geese? What is the purpose of this? <laughs> what is with this shot? He has a bag of bread and he's walking around in a jumper in the goddamn heat. If so, then we both share something. Something unbreakable. Something remarkable. Never fall short to the false obstacles some call roadblocks. I'm a walking example and breathing blueprint to what resilience can display regardless of the sagittal divide and support. So like this whole thing didn't make any sense to me. I don't know if he, this is where I feel like he fucked up when he used the thesaurus. Cause sometimes the thesaurus will give you a word that kind of means what the, what the word you initially looked up means. Um, so he said sagittal divide and support. So he's saying he's a walking blueprint of uh, success regardless of all the support he's received like he's saying that yeah I, I made it even though i was getting supported i mean <laughs> and then the word sagittal let's look at the definitions of the word sagittal it's an adjective uh so definition one of or relating to the suture between the parietal bones at the roof of the skull or to a venous canal within the skull and parallel to this suture I don't think that's what he meant. Uh, 1B of that uh, definition is in direction or location from front to back in the median plane or plane parallel to the median. I don't think that's what he means. And then definition two, pertaining to or resembling an arrow or arrowhead. See, I think he might have like looked up sharp and like that's what he got. And then he was like, yeah, 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 that sounds good. Sagittal's a big word. They'll think I'm clever. You see hate? This was just funny to me because he didn't pick a song that was long enough for his entire video. So the song restarted halfway through the video and it sounds really dumb. It kind of crescendoed at the end there and then just it hard cuts to restarting. I don't know why he didn't just find a longer song or cut the song so that it sounded like it just crescendoed the whole time uh, as opposed to just hard cut to restarting. It just sounds dumb. Hate is nothing but an expression of colluded emotions. Hate can be controlled. Now, his use of colluded here was correct, but I don't know if he knew that it was going to be correct. Because, I mean, the definition of colluded is to act together through a secret understanding, especially with evil or harmful intent. So, I mean, it's technically correct. I mean, hate could be 
a bunch of emotions colluded together um like envy you know desire um sadness depression you know things like that um but i don't think he knew that he was getting it right i think he thought it meant something else hate can be tamed hate is nothing but an insecurity within oneself but can be overcome giving human specific labels makes me slightly uncomfortable but i thank all categories regardless i have no clue what the fuck that meant giving humans specific labels makes me slightly uncomfortable i i don't i don't know what that means that that's that's how human that's how society works you get you get labels if you're a teacher and you teach they call you a teacher if you're a musician they'll call you a musician i i, I don't understand where he's coming from so to all of my supporters fans, members of the covenant, and all of my emotional haters that are truly disguised. I thank you. Your years of words have allowed me more motivation in myself than I have ever had in my entire life. Some of the messages I receive are unbelievably touching. They're humbling. I don't see how he can have any messages that are humbling him himself or he himself, forgive me, has claimed on multiple occasions to be a narcissist, to have a gaunt complex and to be extremely arrogant. Nothing should be able to humble you. You see, the creator has blessed me, has blessed me with a gift, a gift to allow others sanctuary through my actions, through my words. Each and every last subscriber, you mean something to me. I am a product a breathing product kept alive by you this message can be delivered to each and every soul that i speak to individually yeah that that whole thing i feel like he kind of got away from himself he's like this mission this message can be delivered to even each and every soul that i speak to i i don't know what you're talking about i thought this was a message for your subscribers so this message will be delivered to your subscribers right what do you what are you sending this out in a, in a text? Close your eyes. Know your worth. Never let anyone tear you down for they do not possess the power of entry that is the mind. That made absolutely no sense. So yeah, it's good what he said in the beginning. Don't let people tear you down. Uh, don't let their words get to you. But then he says, for they do not possess the power of entry that is the mind. So, okay. The way the sentence would be fra framed is, they do not possess the power, and then what the power is is going to be explained, of entry. So, of entry. So, the power is entry. What is entry? How does that power work? That is the mind. What are you talking about? Did you start a new sentence? Like, <laughs> that didn't make any sense. Evolve past your current self and understand what you provide is meaningful. So, with all of that being said, Thank you for three years of love and support. Thank you. 10,000 subscribers and many more. See, it happened again. Like, why didn't he just cut it off right there? Like, when the audio ended, like, the, the sound picks back up. <laughs> like, why? Or why not just extend or maybe cut a little bit out of, like, the, like, uh, crescendo to make it so that it lasts a little bit longer and cuts to at the end of the video? Why did it pick back up? It sounds really bad. Low Tier God or Dale Wilson or Daylon, Dylon whatever sparrow is a riddle wrapped in a mystery inside of an enigma i have no clue how he operates in his warped mind but it was funny uh die uh, you know breaking down this video and just listening to it because I, i've seen it like in other things before and it's always been funny to me like watching other people play his video in like troll videos and things like that but every time i listen to it i'm like you gotta be a special kind of moron to come out with something like this.